Welcome as you join us in an exciting Dominion Power Kingdom Experience Holy Spirit Authority Pack session brought to you by Global Diplomat College Center and Forbes Global. Now, as you join us in this online Kingdom of God seminar now in progress with God's Holy Prophet and Ambassador of the Kingdom of Heaven, Joseph Forbes, we are transforming students into leaders and leaders into agents of change. Part 2 Seek first the Kingdom of God. Seek first the Kingdom of God. Part 2 The Bible is not a religious book. The Bible is about a beautiful, wonderful story of a king, a kingdom, and children of a king. <laughs> that is awesome. Wow. I will look here at two objectives. One, Christianity is a religion. Two, the theology of the 21st century churches is not the principle or the theology of the Bible. God's original purpose, what Jesus Christ focused on when he was on earth, is the kingdom, a country, an invisible country. God never established a religion. People ask, what are the world four major religion? One, Christianity. Two, Islam. Three, Hinduism. Four, Judaism. The world primary religion fall into two categories. Abrahamic religion, Christianity, Judaism, Islam, and Indian religion. Christianity is a religion. This is a sad statement. For 1800 years, you and I produce and establish a religion called Christianity. You may have said, Ambassador, what is a religion define? A religion is a belief expressed through ritual, custom, rites, producing a unique group of people. All religion worship a deity. From that worship, they have their belief. Their belief system produce ritual. Their belief system is a product of their ritual. That is amazing. That is powerful. Their belief system is the product of their ritual. Write this down, please. NIV, my 15, 8, 9. The people draw nigh to me with their lips, but their heart is far from me. These people honor me with their lips, but their heart is far from me. Ninth verse. They worship me in vain. Their teachings are mainly human ritual. Worship warning, warning all people of the earth who offer empty, meaningless worship. The 21st century church today have a lips worship, but remove the heart from me. Worship of doctrine, the commandment of man in false worship. Wow. Write this down. It is written, my house, not the church building, 
not the steeple, but the people. My house shall be called the house of prayer. But you have made it a dance of robbers. More robbers in the church than incarcerated. <laughs> now, the prosperity gospel is wrong. It has been founded by the apostolic fathers. His name is Clement. His name is Clement Alexander. Clement Alexander. He was born in Titus. Most likely, he was born to a family. His parents were pagans. His parents were pagans. He was born an artist. And he sought out truth from Nelly teachers in Greek, Low Italy, Serbia, Palestine. Primarily, Alexander, a city of one million inhabitants. There he taught in about 190. Clement opened up his own school with more likely a circle of conferences. Yet this was yes, taught the new philosophy, the new Christianity. The new Christianity was the prosperity gospel. Wow. Now, Clement born 150 AD, died 215 AD. He was a Christian theology, theologist. He also was a Christian philosopher. Clement also teach about the prosperity gospel. The people draw nigh to me with their lips, honor me with their mouth, but their heart is far from me. Write this song, please. This is interesting. Now, after Jesus, uh, after John was put in prison, Jesus came to Galilee preaching the gospel of the kingdom of God. Not the prosperity gospel, but the gospel of the kingdom of God. Wow. Saying the time is fulfilled. The kingdom of God is at hand. That's mean it is arrived. It's now. Hallelujah. The kingdom of God is alive in me. I can feel it in my bones, in my heart, in my life. It's alive in me. Wow. Repent. Repent and receive the gospel. Your, what repentance mean? Your thinking is wrong. Change your thinking. Change your corrupt thinking. Change your religion. God's country is here right now. All Christians are a product of Catholicism. Wow. Now, my job as a prophet and an ambassador is, or my assignment is, to teach you about the concept of the foundation of the scripture, of kingdom concept. If you do not understand kingdom concept, your concept will be misunderstand the Bible. You will misunderstand the Bible. Wow. Now, now, what is worship of Christianity. What are the rituals? One, they sing a few songs. Two, have a few testimonies. Three, take up a large offering. Four, have a sermon. Five, they begin to teach their ritual. 
Jesus Christ never ever founded a religion. The number one opposition to the kingdom of God is a religion, religious people. Kingdom is a country, not a religion. Now, it is difficult to change the thinking of of folks who are from church membership to kingdom citizen. What I want to do in the Holy Spirit is change you from church membership in the kingdom citizen. It is difficult to change you from a religious Christian to sons of the kingdom. The sons would have your rights, citizens' rights. You have rights because a Christian have no rights. They're powerless. But a citizen have rights. But seek ye first his country, the kingdom. Seek ye first the kingdom. God's original plan to establish his heavenly kingdom in the hearts of all mankind. When being asked by the Pharisee, when will the kingdom of God come? Jesus answered, Lo, the kingdom of God do not come with observation. Here, see there, or here. But the kingdom of God is within you. Righteousness, peace, and joy in the Holy Ghost. Righteousness and justice and joy in the Holy Ghost. Now is the time for you to be a kingdom citizen. Now is the time to experience kingdom life. Now is time to abandon ritual, tradition, and religion and cleave to Abba Father, which in heaven, holy is your name, your kingdom come where on earth. God extend his kingdom on earth. God extend his kingdom on earth from Jesus Christ, the faithful witness, the first born from the dead, who love us, wash us from our sins, and cleansed us from our sin and made us kings, not Christian, and priests. The word king is the same word where you have your rights. I mean kingdom, kings and kingdom goes together. Made us kings where you have a right and priests. Priests mean spiritual representative. You are this Kingdom Seminar has been brought to you by Global Diploma College Center through all the ambassadors in the Embassy Centers. Matthew 24, 14 declares, And this Gospel of the Kingdom shall be preached in all the world as a witness to all the nations, then shall the end come. For God did not send His Son into the world to condemn the world, but that the world might be saved through Him. We want to thank and appreciate all our subscribers and viewers all over the world. Thank you so much for being partners with us in proclaiming the gospel of the kingdom. If you are not subscribed yet, please subscribe to this channel, Global Diplomat College Center, and click that notification bell for the update videos. God bless you and your families. God bless all the nations of the world. Glory to God alone, King of kings and Lord of lords.